a revealing report in Noteworthy marking uh, Eating Disorder Awareness Week shows how the health system is failing people with eating disorders. Only 55% of the staff for three new teams promised for 2021 um, have been recruited. Less than one third of av available funding has been invested at all since 2016. There is no implementation plan for the recruitment and training of staff according to an FOI, despite the HSC previously stating that there was one in place in a response to my PQ. Many people have to go to the UK for treatment and are forced to spend thousands for private care. And obviously, if you can't afford to travel or get private you care, you just don't get that care. Eating disorders are incredibly serious as the psychiatric condition most associated with mortality. I've been raising this issue for over a year now, and despite continued assurance from you and the Ministers for Health, there is worryingly little progress. What will your Thank government you, do to address uh, this? Minister Mary Butler, please. Thank you, Deputy, for raising this really important issue, and it is Eating Disorder Week. Uh, last year, 504 people um, were referred to the eating disorder teams. When the clinical programme was put in place in 2018, they assumed at that time, judging by the correspondence and the data they had, that there would be approximately 60 people referred into eating disorder teams. So it was 504, an increase of 120%. Yesterday I met with Dr Michelle Clifford, who is the clinical director for eating disorders. 55% of the staff who is, who, is, who is the clinical director for eating disorders um, in the country. And we had a very good meeting, and I met with Bodywise also. But I do, Kian Corla, want to put on the record record of the house that last year 44 new staff were um, clinical staff were hired into eating disorder teams so we originally had three staff three teams and we have populated them we had three new teams last year um, and we're Minister populating them so what I have to say is of the staff it is slow but progress is being made and to have 44 new um, clinical people into the eating disorder teams all over the country is very welcome thank you very much